Seriously, Jared, I can't take this stupid city anymore. Everyone here is so self-absorbed with no regard for human decency. Weren't you raving about how amazing this place was last week? Who's the unfortunate victim who brought you on a coffee date this time? Well, if anything, I'm the victim. This guy, he's some kind of designer, and he takes me out to this theater from the 50s and forgets our tickets. Then, afterwards, he tries to take me to dinner at 7-Eleven. Well, 7-Eleven is pretty high-class service. I don't know what you're complaining about. You know, fully well, that guy's a waste. In fact, most of the guys I end up seeing are scumbags. I just want something real. Something... Well, Cinderella, I understand you're lovesick, but we have bigger fish to fry. I get it. I understand you. You will find your DiCaprio later. Hooking up does not pay the bills. Okay, listen. You emotionless moron! I just don't go on dates to hook up. I, I want to find meaning in my life. Love has always been a problem for me, and you know that. If I just find the right one, then my world will finally be complete, and in this time in my life, more than ever, I need this. Listen, Claire, I don't think you get love out of Tinder dates. And I don't think you're going to find love in a metropolitan, grimy dump full of nine to five offices and studio apartments. You really have no sense of empathy, do you? Why does everything I say always fall on deaf ears? All right. I get it. I understand you, Claire. But you can't find love here. You have to live first. You have to accept reality. What's reality? You don't understand what you're saying. Why can't you wrap your head around the fact? Stop! Listen to me very carefully. You have to make X amount of money even to keep living in a place like this. And most of your income, where does it go? Your ludicrous little dating escapades. I get it. The world not, might not be fair. You might have not gotten that pony when you were sweet 16. But life isn't fair. I knew you wouldn't get it. You're too absorbed in your corporate bubble. Get out. Get out! That's what it takes to stay alive here. So be it.